Welcome, I'm Aditya from Steemax and today we are taking a deep dive into a byproduct of one of the most staple crops in India, that is rice. When we think of rice production, we often envision vast, lush peri fields or the aromatic plains that form the base of countless dishes across our diverse nation. But beyond this, there's an often overlooked product that emerges from this process, that is rice husk. Rice husk may not seem like a remarkable resource at first glance, but its presence and potential are more significant than you may realize. After all, it's cheap and widely available across the country due to the prevalence of rice farming, which makes it an accessible biomass fuel option. As with all things, the complete picture is a mix of both light and shade of advantages and challenges alike. On the one hand, the benefits of rice husk are noteworthy. Its availability across India makes it a readily accessible biomass fuel aligning with our increasing shift toward sustainable energy resources. Its small size also plays a role in its favor, as it is easily compatible with automatic fuel feeding systems, thereby streamlining the process and enabling efficient fuel management in certain applications. On the other hand, the characteristics of rice husk also present a set of unique challenges. To start, it has a relatively high ash content, up to 18%. This high ash content results in a low gross calorific value up to only 3200 kilocalories per kilogram which can limit its energy potential. Further adding to its complex nature is its low bulk density of around 150 to 200 kg per cubic meter. Because of this, rice husk takes up more space than other types of biomass necessitating larger storage space and complicating transportation logistics. These factors can significantly increase operational cost, presenting a challenge to its widespread use. The high ash content of rice husk also has environmental implication. When burned, it generates more particulate emission than some other forms of biomass. As our country and our world strive towards reducing air pollution, the high emission level of rice husk could necessitate increased investment in air pollution control devices Exiting ash from burning rice husk also tends to be of a higher temperature which can lead to a decrease in overall efficiency of the combustion process. This coupled with the high silica content in the ash that can cause abrasion over time may pose additional challenges in the long run. So as we can see the story of rice husk as a fuel is not straightforward. It's a narrative of balance of weighing the pros and cons. But it's important to remember that understanding these complexities and continuing to innovate and adapt is a vital part of our journey towards more sustainable energy practices. As we navigate the renewable energy landscape and continue to explore the potential and challenges of diverse resources like prices, we hope to bring you along on this journey. So stay tuned for more in-depth discussion analysis and insight as we delve into the world of different biomass fuels and beyond.